I had a feeling we were going to have a really rough um, June, so we went out and we overplanted a lot of crops. Luckily we did, or we'd be out of vegetables. Here's a pretty good example of what happens when you don't have sun. These poor eggplant plants. And they should be near the size of the tomatoes, but no sun, and that's it. They just sit there, so they'll be late. So we'll have late eggplants this year. See, like these beans here, normally I could cultivate them with machine both sides of the rows, but they're so tall that the tractor would shove them over and flap them. So that's going to be hand hoed tomorrow. That's not an emergency, so we're performing triage on the fields right now. <laughs> Worst. Worst of the worst. Here's a great example of wet soil that we tried to make raised beds in this morning. That, that sort of smeared level is really hard to run the seed through. So instead of seeding, direct seeding, we're going to transplant it back tomorrow. Hopefully the moisture will evaporate. It'll be a little easier to get some things in. But that's, that's been pretty typical of the past month. Right there. Here's another example. We can't use the whole row. We can't use the whole field. So you can see the top we planted. You can see the two rows on top of the bed. That was where the cedar was. But we had to give it up down here. And as of yesterday, this was all. This was water. This wasn't even. You couldn't see the soil on the bottom. We lost the watermelons. We lost our first planting of cucumbers. We lost our second planting of beans. The fifth planting of lettuce went under. The third and fourth plantings of arugula. The fourth planting of radishes that went. The second planting of Swiss chard that we lost that. Um, I think that's it though. But luckily we we do weekly plantings. Mm -hmm. So you know people understand. It's yeah. good. People around here really they know we're not out here slacking off. So we're catching up. Today we've got a lot done. We did, um, I think we're going to get through six acres today, which is a big day. It's always, if this was easy, everyone would do it.